Hey guys, it's Koreana. I know I haven't posted in a while. I've been super busy with work, trying to finish things. My aunt's wedding is next week, and so is her birthday, and then grandpa's birthday, and then Mother's Day, and then my sister's birthday, so. And then I've had requests to make gifts and, and orders, so. I'm going to show you what I have done, and hopefully this won't be too long. Since I mentioned my aunt's birthday and her wedding, these are the wedding presents for her and her husband to be. My mom's gonna turn them into keychain, and since it was rough still from me sanding, I sanded it more so it's not rough, but I painted the sides gold since their wedding colors are royal blue and gold and my mom's birthday was just Thursday just finished this because it the back wasn't done I didn't wear enough on the first time so it was sticky and then this little guy I had to finish because again the back was sticky from this time it was from tape. There's a little bit right there of spillover, but she already knows about it and she says she doesn't care. But now it's fully finished. And then for a friend, I made a bunch of pusheens and she asked for one and she likes coffees and teas. So I thought this one was perfect and she likes green and blue. So I chose green for this and then green beads. I started some of the zodiac keychains. Here's one and then if you can see it on my screen. This is the Taurus one. Gave it to a family friend because her birthday is today. And then another birthday present that I did for my mom. This is my Instagram. Any of those ones. I just opened it on my tablet so I can show you because I cannot add pictures from my phone into the video. So I did the snowflake because I got a snowflake mold and she is obsessed with snowflakes. And then I also did this for her. Mm, these little tiny cranes the size of my thumbnail so she could make earrings. And then... These just came out. I didn't do enough for the back. They are super shiny. So they need they need more. Because obviously the back is there's like a lip. And I need to sand a little more. But these are from that uh, Korean Asian I'm not quite sure what where the brand is from, somewhere over there, pack of princesses, but this is the frozen one, and then this is supposed to be part of my aunt's birthday present, but it got spill over when I was doing the back, so I need to add, I tried to peel most of it off, it just wouldn't, and it's rough, but I put dried, crushed rose petals in. I'm just gonna make it a little necklace for her because I have no clue what she wants and she said I could just make her something. And then a friend decided to order these. I had done the red one. This just came out of the mold and then I attached the keychain bit for his girlfriend. So he just, I asked him what kind of necklace. He just said ball chain just in case because he wasn't even sure. And then in the plain keychain, because she's not like super girly or in, into lots of beads and stuff, he said. So he asked me to make a burger one, and then he asked for the marshmallow one. I'll be giving them to him soon. I did this. This one was an experiment, and again, I painted the edges super messy so I might just sand this all off 
and then restart. But it's got a dried flower and then the hummingbird. There you go. And then the teacup from my Alice in Wonderland mold set. Not sure what I'm going to do with it yet. And then Beauty and Beast coaster for my best friend. However, there is watermarks because I didn't seal the edges enough. She said she doesn't care because I showed her the picture. And I mixed basically to make rainbow glitter but in person or it's got more of a greenish pink tint because I added more of those and then pink on the background. I have to peel some of the excess glue off though. And then there's this one that needs sanding. This is with roses in the background and then it's one of those stickers from a Christmas envelope. I just decided to say heck with it and use it anyway. This is the pink pusheen. It's just laying down. And the orange one is sitting. And it's making a face. The yellow one is in a box. Which so reminds me of my cat because she's a box cat. And then purple is just walking with a happy face. The white is with the donut. Blue green, which is coming up super blue right now because of the sun on my camera. Don't think I can. Oh, you guys can't, can't even see it now because <laughs> the phone is shadowing it. I still can't tell. Okay, there you go. It's now you can see that it's blue green, but like here it's very blue. But this one's with a cake with a strawberry on top. And then the dark blue one is a cookie. I do have some light blue ones. I think I might just make this like a keychain series and put it on my Etsy. Or give them as gifts and then whatever's left will go on Etsy. But I'm not quite sure yet. Uh, there's a few other things that I made and I put on my Instagram. But like I said, can't do pictures from my phone into the video and I need a video editing software again for my computer but like I said my sister's birthday is also coming up so the pink Batman that's glowy with the blue I found this green beaded piece in the jewelry box that my mom got while helping her clean it and then the Hello Kitty one let's see if it will let me scroll over before this gets to 10 minutes so you can see there's one other thing that I made. Someone asked me to make them this for a trade. So it looks like that. So there's that. So I'm far this is everything and as you can tell I'm still working on keychains. I just wanted to get that done because this is a lot-ish already and I still have a lot to do. Like I said, I got to do this again, sand those at the back, get some doming in the back, put this on something, all, all that good stuff. So, bye guys. See you in my next video.